Hello everybody, coming at ya live through the power of your mobile phones. Before we get into this, before you buy of the new update, get your juice box. <sighs> Sit back, relax, and let me save you thousands of dollars. So, first things first, artifact hall. This is where all your artifacts are if you know anything about the update, and if you don't know, we're gonna save you literally thousands of dollars today. So, like I said, sit back, relax, and let's just hang out. First things first, if you click on Artifact Fair, an antique chest right here, you can see every single artifact that's come out. But don't panic, because you don't actually even need most of these. And it's going to differ depending on what level your account is and what you're trying to do, right? But what if I told you for $26 per month, I could get you uh, like 161 artifact chests? Or just 26 chests now? Which one would you choose? For $26 per month, I can get you 161 chests of the artifact store. And th those are right here. I'll show you that right now as I pet the wiener doll. Artifact fair. Open right here. Open two more chests. And I get a guaranteed epic or higher. And the artifact special right here. This is where you can actually buy them. Okay. So... For the same, for $26, right, per month, I can get you 161 chests, openings, or just 23. And here is how it's done. What you're going to want to pick up is right here, and it's called the 7-Day Bundle. Not that one, this one. The 7-Day Dash Bundle. You get all of these items over the course of 7 days, and down below right here you can see how much I'll move my face you can see exactly how much you get per day to eight dollars per month right so eight dollars divided by the four weeks in the month is how much one time cost you we're doing simple math eight dollars per month it's gonna get you a total it's gonna get you a total of nine thousand eight hundred crescents okay nine thousand eight hundred of these the next thing that you're going to want to pick up is the 30-day monthly supply. 30-day supply chest from the mall, and that's, a, that's everything that it includes. Most of this doesn't matter. You get some, some free gems, some free speed, some gold, some resources, but the most important thing is the artifact times 400 per day over the course of 30 days, right? 12,000 artifact coins per month at the cost of only... $10. So we're only at $18 here so far, okay? Only $18, and we've already managed to get more than 20,000 artifact coins, okay? The next thing is going to be the login bonus, right? You can get some coins in your login bonus. Mine has not updated for some reason, so I don't, I don't get login bonus um, co uh, things right here, but you might be able to get them through here. Um, don't quote me on that, because... Again, I, I don't have it, so I can't say you know definitively, yes, you can, or no, you can't. But make sure you check out your login bonus. It'd be the bonus gift over here on the side, and you could purchase some like that, okay? And the last thing is the gold pass. You go over here to Kingdom Labors, and then you click on this for gold pass. For $5.99, okay, you can get 100 artifact coins times 81, so 8,100 coins at only six dollars per month for the cost of right around 26 dollars pre-tax we've already managed to get you 161 openings 26 dollars gets you 161 chests in one month versus 23 chests immediately so you're definitely just gonna want to slow roll this slow ball it this update gives us so much customization in our stats like we haven't ever seen in lords mobile before for example here's my stats at the time of opening these, the only thing that really matters right here is the cavalry attack HP of like 13%. But you can pick and choose the stats that you want off of these artifacts. So don't waste your enhancements, your brushes, and your, your books, right, on this on this crap, on construction speed or trap training speed. Don't don't do any of that. Do things that suit you, that suit your play style, and that suit your account right? If you're a rally lead account, you're definitely going to want to get some of these attack stats. Like this research and travel speed, probably not that helpful to you. But this cavalry attack, you're definitely going to want to get that cavalry attack if you're a cavalry rally lead, right? The next thing I want to talk about is artifacts themselves. There's some that are really good, 
like cavalry tech, and some that are just garbage. Construction speed. Pick up the ones that fit your playstyle, the ones that fit your need. If you're a level 7 account and you want to get construction speed, do it. But if you're level 25, you have no business getting a construction speed. You can also get free coins by just being an active member in your guild. Guild Bash, Guild Fest, KVK, Dragon Arena, and those are just four of the things that you can get these artifact coins from. And if you have any questions about this update, like, oh my goodness, what should I get, what should I not get, join the Discord community. In the Lord's Mobile chat, we can talk about it. Talk in line chat, or WeChat if you have it. Ask your R5, ask the rally leads, ask the experienced players, right? See what their two cents is. And they're going to tell you, you know, get what you need and not what you don't. And of course, if you're a big spender, of course you can max this out on day one for thousands of dollars. But if you're not a super rich boy or you don't want to we'll just throw away that kind of money when you can do it slowly over time, do it the smart way. So this before you buy is going to say slow roll it for $26 per month. And in a couple of months, you will have everything to level three and level four. And, every, and if you want to, you know, rush one or two of them, then maybe pick up the discounted pack or something. But don't think you have to spend thousands of dollars to get it today when you can just do it later down the line. Slow and steady wins the race. Something that I want to cover real quick is that you can accept turf quests to get extra coins for free at the cost of about 120,000 total might. Preface, before you quote me and clip me on this, if you can take 120,000 might and not be a detrimental to your might, it doesn't make a big difference, then pick up these free ones for free and you're all good. If you, one, don't want to accept the might, two, refuse to accept the might, or three, feel uncomfortable accepting the might, then just don't pick it up, right? But it's just another option for you if you really want to accept these turf quests. Right down here, you can get some. So, for example, 500, 600, 650, 700, 750, right? And they give you all of these bonuses. So this is not me telling you to go and claim all of these quests. Don't do that. But it is me saying, hey, if you want to, it's not a horrible idea. Slow and steady gives you five times the amount of efficiency. You're gonna spend one fifth of the cost that you would if you just open them right out and you get five times the result. One fifth, right? Five times as efficient. Hit that like button. Subscribe if you like this kind of content and make sure you share this video so other people don't mistakenly drop thousands of dollars on this update when you can literally drop a couple hundred bucks and over four months have some super sexy, amazing stats. Juice break before we leave. I will catch y'all in the next one. Peace. Don't forget to join the Discord community. The link is in the description down below. Come and join us live on Twitch and get to see the content ahead of time.